An underrated team currently dominating the NCAA W right now is the Nebraska Huskers. And while they aren't necessarily a ranked team that would be able to compete with the likes of Iowa, Stanford, Yukon, and South Carolina, the fact they've gone undefeated through seven games is incredible. They're being led by a sophomore guard named Jazz Shelley, an Australian from regional Victoria. And the transfer from Oregon is now breaking out for this overall young squad. As an Australian myself, I've been keeping an eye on the incredible play of Jazz to begin this season. And with her not seeming to slow down anytime soon, I feel like it's only right I pay some respects and shine a light on the Australian women hooping at the collegiate level. As for the most part, these players go under the radar due to the mainstream media loving to focus solely on the big name teams. So, in today's video, I'll be discussing Jazz Shelley's season so far the areas of her game that make her so dominant, and how far I believe her and the Huskers can go this season. Before we start, if you're new here and enjoy the video, be sure to subscribe for more women's basketball content like this. I'd love to reach 1,000 subscribers on this channel by the end of the year, so all support would be greatly appreciated. Anyway, with that being said, let's talk about Jazz Shelley. Jazz Shelley is a 5'9 guard from a small town in Australia called Mo, where she grew up and found her passion for basketball playing for the local club. People around her state she has one of the greatest desires to play at the highest level, and as a result, she's worked her way up from local basketball to state basketball to the national squad for Australia, and now is playing at an all-American type level at the collegiate level. After transferring from Oregon, where she received just limited playtime in her freshman year, Jazz Shelley has had a red-hot start to a 2022 season in Nebraska, as her coaches have led her off the leash to begin this season. As of when recording this video, she's certainly not letting this opportunity slip. Through seven games, Shelley has led the Huskers to an unbeaten record of 7-0, averaging numbers of 14.6 points per game, just under 5 assists and 7.4 rebounds. Through these games and larger opportunity for Jazz, she's showcased her biggest strength to the country, that being her scoring and shooting. As I mentioned, she's averaging nearly 15 points per game on the season, but has had multiple games scoring well above that, such as a 22-point game in the second match of the season, or a 30-point game the other day against Drexel, where she simply could not be stopped. Shelley's scoring comes from her offensive creation abilities, as she's able to shoot well off the dribble as well as get into the lane for floaters or layups. At just 5'9", it would surprise you how big of a presence Shelley seems to be inside, offensively and defensively. This to me is indicated by the high number of rebounds she gets per game, something surprising to see for a guard her size. I mean, she's had three games this season where she's grabbed nine rebounds or more, and in one of those games against Alabama A&M, she brought down six offensive rebounds. It's amazing stuff, and truly indicates Shelley's heart over size mentality that's made her such a prominent threat for opposition and has allowed her to break out in Nebraska after limited play in Oregon. Back to scoring though, while Shelley is a great shooter and scorer off the dribble, she's also elite off the catch. On the season, Jazz is shooting 57% from the field and 62% from three. That's just absolutely insane. These figures aren't even coming on low attempts per game either, as Shelley currently averages over five three-point attempts per game. For her to be making those shots at such a ridiculously high clip, at such a ridiculously high volume as well, highlights her immense talent and potential. Again, she's just a sophomore. And while we can expect this beyond elite shooting to drop off a bit, I think it's a part of her game that's going to continue to make her brilliant and dangerous as an offensive weapon for the Huskies throughout the season. So don't expect this to fall drastically, and at the very least, not slow down anytime soon. The offensive creation abilities don't stop there for Shelley though, as she's shown her capability to be a great playmaker as well throughout this season. Jazz wants to get her teammates involved. Togetherness is a common mentality at the Huskers, 
and as a result, Shelly's coaches also frequently use her as a playmaker to run plays for the team. It makes Jazz such a special talent as it diversifies her game and increases the Huskers' overall versatility. When she's struggling from the floor shooting wise, she can always turn back to her playmaking to get others involved and keep the Huskers afloat, even when herself she's having an off night. This was evident in the match against Alabama A&M, where Jazz dished out six assists after she initially began struggling from the field. Her passing plays were particularly on display as well against NC Central, where Jazz led her squad to a big blowout win with a triple-double of 14 points, 10 assists, and 10 rebounds. She simply could not be stopped, taking over to lead the Huskers to their biggest win of the season to date. Overall, Jazz Shelley has been an amazing offensive player this season, being the team's best scorer on many nights, as well as the Huskies' playmaker when someone needs to fill those duties. She's got a wide range of moves in her arsenal to give herself space, including step-back jumpers off the dribble, a quick and smooth release that allows her to shoot the ball incredibly efficiently on three-point shots in particular, as well as a crafty inside game where she has a package of floaters and layups she can use to keep defenders on their toes. Add into that her impressive strength at 5'9", which allows her to sky high and rip down rebounds over much taller players, Jazz Shelley has really been the full package for the Huskies early on. She's breaking out into a legitimate All-American type player, or at the very least, a potential player to make a Big Ten team at the end of the year. And in a pretty competitive conference in the Big Ten, featuring teams like Iowa, Indiana, Ohio State, Maryland, and Michigan, that play is going to be extremely important if the Huskers want to have big success come the end of the season. I'll leave it here, plain and simple. The Huskers are not in this position today, 7-0 like they are right now, with the potential to win even more games going forward without Jazz Shelley. Her addition to this team has been unbelievable and has really changed how the team plays and how effective they've been, especially offensively. Jazz Shelley's got the skills to lead this team to a March Madness spot. So, let's talk about Nebraska a little bit more now. Now obviously, Nebraska is yet to play any ranked team this season, so it's probably a bit early to tell how legitimate of a squad they are. But to me right now, I think they're very capable of being a March Madness team and probably would be able to get through to the round of 32. They've got the defensive strength and of course the offensive weapons like Jazz to keep them competitive with other top sides. The Huskers have an extremely tough stretch during January, facing Michigan, the 12th ranked team in the country currently, Iowa twice who are currently ranked 8th and Indiana who are ranked 4th in just a span of 11 days. That's going to throw a lot of adversity the Huskers way. But if Jazz Shelley and co can thrive through that adversity and be competitive with these teams, I think it'll show a lot about what this team is and how good they really are. Again, we're going to have to wait and see how well Nebraska truly stack up. But I think the 7-0 start to this season is good enough for now. Jazz Shelley has an extremely bright future ahead of her as she begins to develop into a star player. And with her showing more and more capability to lead this team to success, it's becoming a very exciting time for Husker fans. Again, the big test for this team is still a month or so away, but with the Nebraska Huskies, led by Jazz Shelley, having been phenomenal to start their season, and as an Australian myself, I just had to talk about their exceptional play today. And that will conclude the video. What do you guys think of this? What are your thoughts on Jazz Shelley and the Nebraska Huskies to you? How well can they go this season? Let me know all your thoughts down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave it a like and subscribe. But with that being said, I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.